They hold no fondness for trespassers. I've placed the facility under emergency lockdown to keep them safe. Let the marauders die in peace, or I will make certain that you die with them. Right, whatever secrets are buried here, we will root them out. And can we stop pretending like we don't know that's mother? I mean, it was so obvious with the hat and the voice changer. That was the woman we were, we were like looking for her journal. It's her journal. We all know it. Oh. No, was I supposed to pretend that I didn't know that so we could have a dramatic reveal? Okay, I I'm sorry, my bad. So we're heading to Transmission Tower Alpha, and I think that's the tower we were at. You know, the one ran by the guy that was creepily affectionate with his tower? Um, however, there is... There is something else in this neighborhood we're supposed to be picking up, and that's for the journalist. I'm just not 100% sure how we get there because looking at the map, it's not immediately obvious. I think it's there. I suppose we could just go around, see it. Thing is, I don't think there's a sort of a passage that just goes around from the back. We have to go around here and that would take us to this area. That's for not the low, it was the electric fling. There is something right there. Oh, it's not there, it's there. Okay, no, you know what? We'll go around and we'll see here. And we'll see if we can get in that building whilst we're here. Save was having, did we? Where in it? Did we come from there? We came from there, right? something else over there. Okay. We will check that. Really? We will check that out later for now. Okay. And how many can I? Oh, look at the movement. Oh, just look at that. Oh, for Felix. No, score four for Zarkov. I mean, I, I, I'm not keeping score. I'm not. I'm just objecting to you keeping score and getting it wrong, really. Although, if that was your way of complaining, because I'm not letting you have any fun, I, I, I do understand. But you have to admit that was kind of cool. You just, you just, you just, you have to admit that. Okay. Rather a lot of blood in here. Hearing another weird. Pick up. Defaced Moon Man helmet. I thought that said defecated at first. Ooh, get tripping over again. Gotta stop doing that. Okay, so that's the defaced Moon Man. Oh. Uh, it makes you more intimidate. It's 25 armor. That's not actually terrible. Um, okay. I've got to know. I, I, honestly, I don't hate it. 
which is terrifying. I mean, I mean, it's no, right? It's a hard no. I mean, it's just, it's, I mean, like, no, right? I mean, no. Yeah? No. But in a way, in a, in, I mean, am I, am I wrong? In a way, it's, it's a, uh, maybe? I mean, it's not good. It's a, it's not terrible armor. I could, I could. No, no, you're right. We'll see how it is when I tinker it up. Yeah, we'll, we'll, we'll. Why, look, I tell you what, compromise. Why don't we just try it out? Try it out and, and see. Yeah, we'll see. Um. You know, just because, because science. We're testing it for science. We're going to see what effect it has on the local marauders because they'll probably be terrified. Because, well, let's be honest. If that doesn't terrify them, nothing will. Uh, right. Yes, we're, we're scientifically researching the effect of psyops on people. Yes, that's what we're doing. That is absolutely... What were we doing? Oh, right, no, we were... Ah, yes, yeah, sorry. <laughs> we're here to pick up something for the, um... Okay. And... Hi! Okay. Oh, no, 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 sorry. Have a go. I'm, I'm going to give you guys a turn. There's another one. Oh, God. Oh, sorry, Elliot. Man, I, I thought you wanted to go. I, I, okay. Felix, are you ready? There's another one. Get him. There you go. Kill him. Oh, really? Okay. Well, don't say I don't let you guys have a go, because I did. And let's be honest, I probably need to give you some better armor. Yeah, it did. I don't know if anybody could live in a place like this. Best they could do is just exist. See, this is why I prefer being a spacer. Okay, yeah, yeah, no, fair enough, fair enough. Good feedback, good feedback. Uh, yeah, no, I will get you both better armor, actually. I, you, you, actually, I've had better armor for you, and I keep selling it, and that's really terrible of me. That is very, very, very inconsiderate. You, I just haven't found anything that looks that good. But I, well, I'll keep my eyes open. I will keep my eyes open. I mean, I, I appreciate at the moment you probably would rather not be falling over than looking good. But... Just to let you know, you do look good in that. That that is that is a good look. It is. It is. All right. So, um, where? Right. We we need to go in there. That's worker domiciles. These are the worker domiciles. We we can check there for loot and stuff later. Is that more people? Yeah, that's more people. Oh, that's even more people. All right, okay. It's just. I've been waiting for this. No, don't, don't just stay at distance, though. Okay. Oh, they're going for you. Oh. Oh. Still one left. That does it. Time for a drink. Yep, sure. Have a drink. Drink them if you've got them. Um, loot them if you see them. Beat them if you can't. Sorry, I have no idea where I was going with that. Uh, oh, I'll tell you where I was going with that. The land of overloaded. So... Let's have a check of the map. We're in roughly the right place, but not quite. We need to get up there. Okay. 
All right, well then let's just just let's just loot for now. And and does anyone remember where there was a uh, was a bending machine? There's got to be a bending machine around here. There's always a bending machine around here. Okay, so the worker domiciles had external uh, bathrooms, so to speak. Really? Okay. It, it may not just have been the drugs that drove everybody mad here. Okay, that is not a good sign. Definitely not something you want to see when currently carrying too much and unable to run away if it turns out that is a... Uh... Okay, it doesn't seem to be a count down. It's more of a count around. Um, let's assume that doesn't mean we're all about to die in a violent explosion any second now. Really? Still no vending machine. No vending machine and... Oh. Still no vending machine, but... Having you along is really useful. Match, I've got 124 picks now. I... Oh, hey, I think I've got some more of the power armor. Which could be for you. I've... Oh, I could probably have given you one of the, the set I already had that I'm not wearing yet because of the... the anyway, doesn't, doesn't matter. Doesn't matter. Here, have some better armor. Oh, looking... Okay. I'm just going to say good, but... You know, I can't help but feel the fedora might look pretty good on you. I... I'm just saying you've got a face that might work with a fedora, but if you were going to go for the fedora, I'd almost say you should stick with the, um... You need to see your face, I guess. Okay, look, 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 look. It's, it's orders of magnitude better armor. Yeah, I mean, it's just so much better. I could give one to Ellie as well, but then I, I, I want to keep one for me. I want to keep one for me. You know what? Ellie wouldn't look too bad in the fedora either, but she's got this going. She's got this. This is engineering. I love this look on her. Yes, I do. Yeah, we might give you a fedora. We might. It's possible. I'll think about it. That armor is actually really colorful. I'm not 100% sure I'm in love with the idea. I may start hitting you. Not deliberately, or semi-deliberately, more because you're wearing something that makes me think you're an enemy. Because you look a bit like an enemy right now. It's, uh, it's a tough call. Okay, last domicile. Okay. And then we're hopping across the roof and... No, we're not. We're going across the roof that way. Okay. Somebody put a... Oh, that is actually... That is... like Because that's my hunting rifle ultra. That's... Where the hell is it? I just picked it up. I just picked it up. It's staring me... There. Of course, it's the last thing I picked up. I mean, look at that. That's actually really going to compete with that thing. Yeah, honestly, I think that's going to win. When we get back, I have got quite a lot of scrapping and modifying and thingying to do. If, if we find a bench, I'm going to be doing it in advance. Still no... Okay. Right, still... No workbench, no vending machine. Yes, I was having difficulty for a second remembering what the hell 
a bending machine was called. That's like a starving man forgetting the word for food. Okay. Well, we found a way up on the other side. What we really need to do is find our way up there. Aha! Elevator! We found it! We found an elevator that will take us up there. And we can... Right. This... Is, um... Different. A package for Captain Babbage. I'm going to take the package for Captain Babbage. To Captain B. Babbage and crew from a friend, handle with care. What is it? Is it alcohol? Is it drugs? Is it an expl Is it a body part? Is it a body part? Is it a body part? It's going to be a body part, isn't it? It's always a body part at the moment. It really is. Just getting a little on... I think I... Yeah, no, I did loot that. Right. Okay, let's get up that elevator and... Hopefully find a vending machine at the top waiting for us. Out of curiosity, if I just... If I just... No, I don't actually move faster. I just move the same speed. I probably seem like I'm moving a lot faster to you guys. All right. Elevator! Oh, thank you! Out of curiosity, what is there? What is here? Marauder Stronghold. Okay, I found a Marauder Stronghold. I got a feeling... I don't need to be there at the moment, but at some point, I am inevitably going to find myself there. The same is probably true of wherever we're going right now. And you could argue I could probably have just, you know, gone back to uh, the tower and would have ended up here anyway. And that's probably a good point. But then, I wouldn't have this, um cool new helmet. Not that it's a cool new helmet, it's a scientific project that we're testing out. Am I? Okay, I, I think we may have wild beasties. Which is an unfortunate moment to get wild beasties, purely because I can't really move particularly fast. <laughs> Where is this going? That is going... No, we actually need to go the... Oh, no, actually, this would take us... Maybe around? To where we need to go? You know what, look. If we're going to find a vending machine, it's going to be this way. And... Vile beasties normally need to run up towards us before... Uh... Okay, a canid sparkler. They're not on us. Oh, I probably should leave the one you're controlling to do its thing. Oh, whoa. Canid charges are pretty damn tough. Whoa. Canid Sentinel. Boom. Boom. R are you dead? I can't. No, you're not. Okay. Go. Are you not dead yet? I can't tell. Usually I can loot things when they're dead. Now you're dead. Okay. Okay. Stop making that bloody awful noise and either attack or die. Right. Okay. That... Please tell me we're not back where we came from. Because that looks like a... Oh! It's the other door! It's the, it's the door. Do you remember? Uh, there, was, there was a door we couldn't get out of while we were in there. You remember? This is it. That is it. It was sealed or blocked or something. Right? Yeah, right. The upper exterior. Ooh. See, now that, that, that is armor I could imagine you. Transition to the office of, yeah. 
Is there a vending machine somewhere near the top here? I'm pretty sure there is. I'm pretty sure there was a vending machine right out here. Maybe, maybe in here? Just round the corner. There! See? Vending machine! Yay! Was there also a workbench? There might have been. Vending machine! If somebody's trying to stop you, that just means you're on the right track. Didn't we see a big communication tower on the way over here? I'm hoping this leads us to someone we can talk with face to face. Or punch, if it comes to that. Well, I'm hoping that too. And yes, we did see a tower on the way over here. And we are heading back to it. We're just... We're taking a very circuitous route there. Because we do actually have a few other things to do as well. We've promised to help a few people out, including a journalist. And that might help us gain some more information on what is going on around here. Because he kept certain notes and things, so... Can you hear that? I thought I heard something, like, 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 like a little humming. No, probably my imagination. If we find a workbench... Okay. If we find a workbench, I... Okay. Uh, guys, come, go. No problem. Over there, both of you. I don't think we're actually going to be going that way anyway, but just in case, right? Put it back. And then yes. Right, another bar looking thing. You know what? I have to say, when people left here in a hurry, they really did leave a lot of valuable things behind. Which is probably for the best. I mean, you shouldn't be stopping to pick up random pieces of gear and things like that. You should pick up the essentials. You know, something that you. Like your keys. If you've got to run in a, in a hurry, take your keys. If your keys have got, like, keys to everything, take them. If you have some sort of mobile communication device with all of your data on it, take that. And shoes. It is sometimes tempting to just run. And if you don't have shoes on, you're just running. And you don't want to spend 30 seconds getting a pair of boots on. But sometimes, trust me, it's worth it. Okay. Diane shoots final report to the co-worker who finds this. Given you're reading this, I'm likely dead. I'm very sorry about that. I'm also sorry Spacer's Choice had to send someone else to finish my assignment. As of the moment I'm writing this, Charles Novak still possesses the express mail delivery prototype. I believe he's gone entirely mad as he has abandoned his apartment and taken up with some group of marauders not far from here. Charles no longer recognizes me. He can't even recognize the Spacer Choices, the Spacer's Choice jingle. When I sing it for him to try and coax him into a calmer state, he shot me in the arm. If you're here to retrieve the prototype, here is what you should know. The prototype remains intact. The prototype has been modified to simultaneously fire project, uh, multiple projectiles, and the original package housing chamber appears to have been replaced with an explosive payload. Oh, wait, 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 hasn't one of the, wasn't the, wasn't one of the raiders supposed to have a rocket launcher? Is this the rocket launcher? Charles Novak, was it Charles from accounting or something? Okay, anyway, please know that I did not sanction these modifications, nor do I approve of setting fire to company correspondence. Charles' depravity knows no bounds. The original prototype was only intended to deliver packages more quickly. Nothing more, and I'd sooner die than see it used for violence. To that end, I'm going to try and recover the prototype from Charles. Should I fail, please remember me fondly despite my incompetence. Faithfully, Diane Shute. 
I'm pretty sure it is then. I think that must be, it must have been Charles from accounting or something like that, yeah? Okay, somebody s stabbed. Would that have been Charles? Was he, was he trying to stab her with Adrena time? Can't be leaving the aged whiskey. Okay, stop picking stuff up that really is not needed at this point. Stop it. Ammo, ammo is okay. Ah! It's just so very hard not to. It really is. It's like it's it's tough. It's hulking cranial helmet. Do what? Okay, that just looks like all the other ones we found. But, wow, is that a lot of armor. That is, indeed, a lot of armor. Okay, never mind. All right, so, we know the story about the rocket launcher is probably true, then. Interesting. We definitely want... Chibold Excelsior... Okay, okay, why can I not pick that up? Why can I not pick that up? Why can I not? <laughs> That's just wrong. That is wrong. Ah, okay, we've got... We've got one of those message things. And... Lots more armor and bits. They've got reassuringly large viewing panels here. I approve. Okay. Hey, Dr. Ambrose, tell me about Adrena time. <gasps> what does it do? This is what we were here for. Hasn't Clarence already dumped a pile of promotional materials on your head? Where's the fun in that? My listeners want to hear it in your own words. <sighs> It's an injectable drug that improves a patient's speed, awareness, mental acuity, and endurance. In moderation, Adrena Time will uplift the laboring classes by strengthening their minds and work ethic. That's quite the mission. What's driving this vision of uplift? I am a solutions-oriented woman. I see a problem and I am moved to solve it. Poverty is one such problem. Through science, I believe we can improve the poor, and in so doing, improve Halcyon. Okay, so she's an idealist of sorts. Now this looks more like the armor you were wearing before, and is actually more armor. You look kind of badass in that, you do. You look kind of badass in that, but honestly, you still look way too like a marauder for me, and I think it's okay if I look like a marauder because I'm unlikely to smash myself in the face with a hammer. I'd prefer it if you didn't. And I can't help but feel that that would somehow look better with the fedora if I decide to give you the fedora. Yeah, you see, see there's a lot, and it's more armor anyway. It's, it's more protection out of curiosity. I'm not saying this is a good idea. I'm also not saying it's a bad idea. I'm just... No. I'm... It, no. This this one is a no. Which is a shame. We are definitely going to have to find you something better. But I just... You just... You just... You look spectacular like that, Ellie. You look like you're... S really? How am I... I'm... Oh, the armor I took off you was, of course, bloody... Heavy. I don't need two sets of it, and I don't think I'm going to give this to Max. So, you know what I'm going to do? I'm going to break this down. We're, uh, it's, oh, it's weight 15. Yep, we're definitely, definitely, you know what we're doing? You know what we're doing right now? We're heading to that tower, but we're also heading back to the ship. We're heading to the tower and to the ship to dump some stuff and, uh, you know... <sighs> Well, basically to dump some stuff. They're actually back. Really? Heads up! Oh. Okay, no, that one, that one's on our side now. Giggle gun has caught him. 
Okay, let's see if I can get this lined up and take them both out with one hit. Oh, we still... I see him. Oh, God. Okay. This one's a... Can you... Everyone all right? Can you get that one sorted without my help? Hopefully. Okay, don't... I'm not taking... I'm not taking that. I'm not taking that. That was him, wasn't it? Or was it this? It? No, I'm not taking that. I'm not taking that because I don't even want to stop now to use the vending machine. No. You guys are making me stop. And... Whoa. And more. One, two... Three, and I think there was a fourth. There is a fourth. There's a fourth. Oh, God, that did not... That did not... Do the job. That one did. Okay. And... Oh, no. Another one. Well done. And... Once again... You had friends, didn't you? Yes, you did. Okay. And one more. And then I think we're home free. I think it's just a straight run to the ship. That is a little strange. When I tinkered this armor up, it suddenly gained a hood. It's now 101 armor rating, which is pretty good, but it's got a hood, and I'm not totally sure how I feel about that. Felix is looking good and has an armor rating of 100. We definitely need to find an upgrade for Ellie. Absolutely want to upgrade her armor. Do return in one piece, Captain. Will do. For now, we're just going to keep her out of harm's way. She can use the shrink ray. I mean, Felix, I'm going to stick with the giggle gun anyway. Honestly, it seems we're actually a lot more effective if I just run in there with the hammer and they support me. I'm liking that idea. Right. Transmission Tower Alpha. And if I'm not very much mistaken, it was on that side. And assuming we don't have any marauders to deal with, we should be able to run straight there. You guys are very, very quiet. Which is odd, because both of you are wearing heavy armor. I mean, I can hear... Oh, no, I can definitely hear you. I mean, that doesn't look as heavy as his armor, but it's, it's rated as heavy. Just a little quiet. Mind you, I actually think I placed Nightingale footsteps on your armor, didn't I? For some bizarre reason. I can't remember why I did that. Maybe I just thought it suited you being a little, uh, quiet. Right. Elevators are a bit slow. I mean, I guess I should be happy about that. If the elevator just shot up, we'd end up plastered on the rock ceiling. Okay, they're back. Okay, that one looks... Always wanted to go strolling through a ghost town. Okay. But they're on us. Yeah. Could you not ruin my mojo? I was... This guy just, for some reason, looks bigger than usual. I mean, I know he's a colossus, but I mean... I don't know. I'm feeling... I'm feeling a little short all of a sudden. And... Oh. Can you 
miss it. I don't know why, but... I just find the squeaking slightly amusing. <laughs> which is terrible, like which is... Like I was saying... Oh, I'm... Let's keep moving before we get all introspective. Like I was saying before, I was so rudely interrupted by us moving and doing stuff. Let's get moving and do stuff. Okay, then. Um, that's not nearly enough bodies. Okay, it doesn't matter. It doesn't matter. We've already got too much stuff. Where was the tower? It was over there. Of course. Yes, right. We're looking for a staff member, a senior staff member, I think, that could help us breach the facilities. Right, there it is. Ah, right. Directory, locate facility staff. We just, we just have new options. Okay. We're finding Clarence. Clarence mostly. Location Byzantium? Musgrave Collection. Thank you for your diligent commitment to personal personnel tracking and surveillance. Wait. Okay, that's very nice. Are we... Wait, do we... Go, we have to go and find... Okay, journal. Clarence Mosley can be found on Musgrave Family Collection at the Musgrave Family Collection, an art gallery located in Byzantium. Your only lead into lifting Gorgon's emergency lockdown is the project's last known staff member, an actuary named Clarence Mosley. If you want to access the manufactory, you need information from him. He's still alive! We've got his eyeball! He's still alive? Really? I was expecting us to find a location of, you know... Well, bits of him, to be honest. More bits of him, to be accurate. But he's actually alive and on Byzantium? Whilst we're in Byzantium, we've got to pick up an outfit for Parvati and um, go and horrifically offend Ellie's family. It was Terra 2, yes? Terra 2. I guess we could do that while we're, while we're there. Shouldn't take... Captain, transmission request from Ambrose Manor. Okay. I'm guessing Minnie wants an update. Fine, patch her through. Captain! Imagine my surprise when I saw the unreliable leaving Gorgon with so much urgency and purpose. Tell me you found Mother's journal. I'm positively dying for good news. Should we have gone and seen her first? Um... Ooh, okay. No, no. Somebody wanted me to stay away from Gorgon and then locked the place down. Yeah. Someone? You mean someone still has access to the facility? Yeah, someone. Who was it? Ooh, we don't know. We don't know. Could be, right, someone with an old grudge. We didn't have a chance to explain. Extra. Yeah, you tell me. Oh, no, a bit, bit of an accusation, that. Um, we didn't have chance to exchange pleasantries. Drat. Yes. Make sure Drat. you have eyes on the back of your head. I doubt we've seen the last of this human vexation. If I know Spacer's choice, getting past the lockdown will be more complicated than just hitting a big red button. You'll need authorization and layers of it. Right. When you say I should have eyes on the back of my head, you mean that figuratively, yes? I mean, I'm asking because recently... It, 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 well, let's just say I'm collecting, you know what, let's not talk about it. Um, are you familiar with Gorgon's old research staff? 
I don't suppose your mother left you any passwords or mysterious key cards. No, no. Are you familiar with Gorgon's old research staff? I seem to recall that Mother worked closely with Gorgon's R&D personnel, but not close enough to invite them over for dinner and cocktails, if you get my meaning. By now, they'll have moved on with their lives. If only I could do the same. Okay. Did you know Gorgon was developing Adrena time? I knew Mother was involved with some important chemical trials, but I had no idea her pet project was Adrena time. Adrena time is a working man's stimulant, like a caffeinoid. Very popular at launch, though the marketing quieted down over time. Yeah, probably because uh, it creates marauders. What? No. I mean, there's some very morbid wording in the fine print, but I had no idea Adrena time could make marauders out of people. That's it. That must be it. Spacer's choice is keeping their dirty little secret about Adrena time off the record. We have to find Mother's journal. If we don't, then Spacer's choice gets away with murder. I only hope we aren't too late. Okay, why would Spacer's Choice risk everything for a stimulant? Well, that's a daft question, isn't it? It's a daft question, but I'm going to ask it because that's what clever detectives and investigators do. They act stupid so that people tell them things. Yes, I learned that from, from detective series. So, yeah, why would Spacer's Choice risk everything for a stimulant? Adrena Time was touted as the working man's best friend. A drug that boosted productivity with no adverse effects. The promise of Adrena time cannot be overstated. Exhaustion and fatigue were supposed to be obsolete. Workplace accidents would be things of the past. For whatever reason, the drug never lived up to that promise. Yeah, I tried it. It was really, really a big letdown. Could one drug really do all that? Mm, probably not. The crash was horrible. I don't know. And thanks to Spacer's choice, we may never find out. I know that I'd oh, like we're to gonna see find a colony out. where the promise of Adrena time was fulfilled. And I doubt I'm the only one. Eh, 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 I'd like to see a colony where uh, Adrena time was not really necessary. I mean, I'm all for science, you know. Generally speaking. Especially if it's the big sort of science that goes... <laughs> That sort of science. But science that, you know, gets you high and then makes you walk really slowly for hours on end. Not a big fan of. Okay, anyway, I'm, uh, I'm going to head back out. You really know your business, Minnie. Thank you very much for the information. You've been very helpful. Thank you. I certainly ought to know what I'm doing. I spent years trying to break into pharmaceuticals, professionally speaking. Mother wouldn't hear of it. She didn't think I had the wit to succeed in her line of work. Safe travels. If your leads give you any trouble, be sure and give them some trouble back, yes? Oh, I think I can manage that.